spots on the map just like clashing with each other. It's pretty pretty ugly. <laughs> all, the lower, all the lower level people, all they could do is uh. Hey KB. You know, all they could do is uh just try to uh. Ran away from you. What a bitch. Hey, but he's running upwards. Oh. Oh, wrong way. It's a dumb idea for me to keep following because there's a PK. Yeah, he's probably trying to... Blur me. I could fall. Yep. Yeah, he's probably trying to bring him to a group. Or, or just a popular PK place to get people to jump you. Nah, uh, I think he meant to run you through there, thinking that they would fight you back. Oh, now that's... <laughs> what an oh. innocent bystander taking all the hits. He's like, thank you. Oh, he's Iron Man, I think, isn't he? Yeah, he's an Iron Man. Who wants to die. See ya, matey. Ooh. That's it, put it on oh, your mouth, sorry. Hey guys, it's Framed, and welcome to Volume 9 of My Wilderness Iron Man. And in today's episode, I did get quite a bit done, but it did take me a long time to upload this, because I have been busy with a lot of things, so I haven't really been able to get much time to go on to this account because if I did go on to RuneScape it was to stream or just to do a little bit of whatever on frames so nonetheless I am not going to be as busy now even though school is coming up again I just had to go do a lot of things so I didn't really have the time but yeah now I'm going to be able to do this more and before I start talking about what's going on I do want to ask for one thing <clears throat> If anyone is able to make intros, I, I might just make it myself, but I'm not sure yet. If anyone wants to make an intro for the Wilderness Iron Man series, obviously I would always put your channel description or whatever you want in the, in the description of uh, all these videos that I use your intros in. But yeah, I think I might need one because the framed intro is nice and all, but it doesn't really pertain to the Wilderness Iron Man, at least in my opinion. Nonetheless, so, why have I taken this long, besides the obvious of being busy in the real life, in a real scape, I have just been hard on supplies, so I just need to constantly loot and constantly do this and constantly do that, and it just sucks, like, because I can't really find many wars anymore, many, uh, like, I, I don't really go to, uh, free-to-play wars anymore, I can't find members wars, because it's just kind of hard to find, you know, and it's just hard to come on, uh, you know, come by supplies, like, I got lucky, I PK blood runes every now and then, you know, here and there for Saradome and Strike, because that's, like, my main spell, but once I run out of that, I'm kind of screwed, you know, I, I have to find another way to do it, but... Anyway, I wanted to actually propose something, and this is going to be in the straw poll. I've talked about this in previous episodes, but I want to start doing skilling, right? <clears throat> and it's really hard to do skilling unless I am in a PvP world. And the only time I'm currently allowed to have access to a PvP world is on stream, and I'm either just allowed to PK, or I'm allowed to do the quests, or a quest, rather, after... I get a five kill streak. All of this, of course, if I did not mention it, has to be on live stream. So pretty much, I am going to be putting a straw poll in the description of this video, and I'm going to give two options to vote for. If you would like me to have access to PvP worlds to do skilling and anything else I need besides quests, of course, I still need to earn those, and you know the whole deal. That's not going to change at all. But if you guys think I should have access to PvP worlds strictly on stream, because that makes it infinitely times harder to do, then vote yes. And obviously, if you don't think I should, then vote no. Uh, I'm not going to say, <coughs> say, excuse me, I'm not going to say you need 75% because that's stupid. But if I think it's a fair majority, then obviously I'm going to choose the option that is in favor, or rather the option that is voted on. Anyway, so as you can probably see on screen, I just got two kills. Uh, I was doing this on stream, of course. All this was on stream. And I actually have three kills now. So as you guys know, if I get two more kills, then I am able to do a quest. And the next quest I want to actually do 
is the Druidic Ritual, I believe, to get uh, Herblore and to be able to start doing Herblore because I've just been training at the Zamorak Mages and... Yeah, <laughs> I get so, like all these herbs. By the way, to expand on a previous idea before, I'm not allowed to train any combat at all unless it's in the wilderness. Uh, I forgot to mention that. If I am not in the wilderness, I am not allowed to train combat, uh, obviously with the exception of PKing because that's not necessarily training. But, you know, as of right now, I'm not allowed to do it unless, again, some like you guys want that or to change that. But I, I kind of don't really want to do that. I really don't see that as much you know, much fun. Like, I'd rather be doing this in the wilderness because I've done everything thus far in the wilderness. Why would I not continue to do all my combat training in the wilderness, you know? It's just kind of hard for me to do skills because, as you can see, I can only do, like, a limited amount of skills. I only had to have two crafting, and I need five to even start doing anything. But, yeah, anyway, I started fletching, by the way, as you can see right now. I didn't get many levels, but I just wanted to start doing a little bit of fletching because I do want to get uh, some more skills up. It's just a bit of a pain in the ass right now. I need to get 15. I think I stopped at 12 because I got sidetracked. But, yeah. Nonetheless, uh, I've been killing a few bosses in this uh, episode, too. As you saw, I killed KBD. I just killed the crazy archaeologist. And then, after that, I decided, you know what? I kind of need to start going for a 5 kill streak because I need one. I need to get a 5 kill streak. And before all of this, I rage deleted the clip, of course, because <laughs> that's all I fucking do. But, uh, no, I'm just kidding. I, I don't always do that, but I, I just rage deleted the clip because I was mad. I just woke up, and I was fighting a dude, uh, and he just killed me. So, you know, even though I had a zero kill streak as is, I died to a level 58 with a G-Mall, which... Uh, if you guys look at my stats, you know, you, by the way, you can always just search up my stats to kind of get a general idea of what I'm doing. That and I always, well not always, but every now and then, I just post things about my Wilderness Iron Man on my Twitter. So, if you want, I mean, you guys can follow that. It's up to you entirely, of course. But, uh, I am making my account right now, so I have 50 attack and however many strength levels I'm going to get. But I need a G Maul because I want to start PKing with a G Maul. The only special weapon I have right now is a Magic Shortbow. And it's okay, but it's not really doing the job right now, you know? Like, I don't think I've ever gotten a single KO so far. I could be wrong. I could. I might have gotten one. I just don't remember it. But as far as memory serves me as of this moment, I do not really get many kills with the Magic Shortbow. Mainly, I get kills with, like, the Rune Crossbow with the Dragon Bolts or something if I'm PKing. Or, like, in against another PK, or, you know, if I'm killing people training in the wilderness, like, on green dragons or whatever, that's when I normally just use Saradum and Strike. Every now and then I'll bring the Magic Shortbow, but, like, the point being is I need a better weapon to start KOing people with, and the fact that I thought I could have gotten one and died pretty much sucks. Anyway, as you can see, I have just been killing noobs at West Dragons because I was normally killing noobs at, uh... <laughs> Noobs. I was normally killing my no, they're noobs, they're noobs. But I was killing people at Lava Dragon Isle, or I was trying to just find people randomly doing things, and I kept running into really high levels, and that wasn't really the ideal thing for me. But the only reason I even started doing this is because I went to go kill Crazy Archaeologist, and I just ran by West Dragons, and I just saw like I, I think I think the guy was actually at the beginning of the clip. Or, like, rather, at the beginning of the PK clips at uh, West Drags, but I saw a dude in, I think, full rune or something like that, and an arty cape. And I was like, I just got, I need to go kill that guy. You know, even though he got away, I was like, I just need to go kill that guy. Look at that guy. Freaking putting up prey. Like, I don't even that much have that much food as is, and he's just putting up prayer. What a noob, right? But. Yeah, like, I didn't even realize I was going to start doing this until, like, I just got the idea. Oh, yeah, I used to PK at West Drags all the time. Oh, yeah, quick side note. That guy picked up ah, picked up his cannon. Excuse me. I don't know why I'm talking like an idiot. But he picked up his cannon, and I thought I was going to freaking get a piece of the cannon. But now, nonetheless, he picked it back up again. And even though I don't show the clips, he kept trying to run back and uh, picking up the cannon. And when I was killing him, he kept putting down the cannon, so... He learned kind of fast that putting it on the cannon will save it. So that kind of sucks. 
So there was also a few clips that I didn't include simply due to the fact that some people got away, you know, some being PKers, some being people that were killing uh, these dragons. And surprisingly, I forgot to mention that there weren't that many bots at this level, like at all. Like I thought there would be many, like a lot more bots, but there just was not that many bots at all. Like all these people were actually people. But yeah, some people got away uh, just because I got unlucky and they ran into mages or this or that. They got the log out. But sometimes, like actually not sometimes, just this one time. But this random guy, no idea who he is, didn't see him in any other worlds. He just randomly comes up to me. He like runs across like he already knows where we are and just starts trying to attack me. And I thought, oh great, this guy got his friend to come help, so... You know, I'm just trying desperately to entangle this guy off of me, you know, so I can kill the other dude, and then I run out of run energy, and oh my goodness, I got so mad. I uh, ended the clip there, but I actually called that guy a cunt, <laughs> because I got that mad. I never do that, like, I never really curse anyone out in RuneScape, but I guess he was kind of asking for it, he was kind of asking for the rudeness. Even though it's the willingness, at the end of the day, he didn't really do anything wrong, because... Like, let's be real, like, I probably would have done that for my friend, too, so, you can't really blame him, I just got mad at him. Anyway, so, I found the guy later on, and I was just waiting for the other dude to come, right? And, I thought that was him, but no, that's not him, really, that's just some random level 72. And I'm level 62 in this clip, so, I'm thinking, oh crap, he's probably gonna kill me. But, you know, I, I safely got away, well, for the time being, like, I got uh, to level 9 and I started to attack this guy, so he couldn't really PJ. But I was just thinking, where's that other guy going to come from? Like, I'm just waiting for that guy to uh, come, you know, attack me and kick me off or whatever. But no, he didn't, he's not anywhere to be seen. So, <laughs> it just kind of begs the question, where the fuck did that guy come from? Like, he just came out of fucking nowhere. Like, he came out of nowhere, he helped him, and then he just disappeared. Anyway, so I actually did get the kill. It wasn't much, it was just a glory. And I don't know why he was running east. Didn't really, I mean, unless this guy was his friend too and he's just on a different account, but I don't know, I, I kind of want to think something different. Anyway, I did get away from that guy, and that guy was a bit of a pain in the ass, but if you haven't been counting, I actually did get my five kill streak now, so um, I think after this I'm on a two kill streak, I'm not sure exactly, but nonetheless, I will let you guys know probably in the next episode. So, uh, what that means is I am going to be doing another quest on stream, and then I am probably going to be doing um, a lot more things on, uh, on stream for my Willis Iron Man, because I have been wanting to stream this, because I think it makes it a little bit more interesting, so you guys get to see what's going on, you know, quote unquote, behind the scenes. Also, this dude randomly did notice me, the one who is training... Uh, range at green dragon so that was pretty sweet to my surprise a lot of these guys actually did fight back too like this guy he was trying to keep coming at me you know so eventually when they pray for a certain amount of time i just switch the prayer and i just you know far cast them or do whatever because again as i said i really don't have that much food on me as is so it kind of gets a little sketchy you know but, nonetheless, uh, I did end up killing this guy too, and uh, I'll put at the end, like, I'll put right here actually what kill streak I'm on because I haven't really been paying attention. But, yeah, anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I am going to be doing a lot of Wilderness Iron Man things on stream, of course. Uh, it's going to be quests, or, you know, it's going to be killing people or whatever because... Again, I'm allowed to kill people and do quests on stream as long as they're in PvP worlds. So, that's what I'm going to be doing for the time being. So, make sure you guys catch one of my streams. That should be fun. You guys can either defend me or you guys can kill me. Well, let's be freaking real. You're probably all just going to kill me, but that's fine. That just makes it a little bit more of a challenge, you know? So, thank you guys for watching, and I am going to get back to training my account right now. So... Yeah, follow the stream, follow my Twitter, and like the video. Vote on the straw poll, by the way, please. That, and again, if anyone wants to make an intro for this, that would be really sweet. Anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.